I'm using charcoal powder. He draws, and she contemplates or prays. Perhaps it's been a hard life, but she has survived, and he has too. I I'm okay because when I'm drawing, I'm happy. She is not so happy, but it's only a moment, a moment frozen forever in charcoal, a person, an expression, the eyes, the faces that together tell the story of the artist. His name is Yai. And my family is a poor family. A portrait of his younger self. He grew up in Thailand, one of eight children. They shared one bedroom. I'm no more kid, but I love to drawing. Yai works at a coffee shop in Raleigh, Black Ivory. But for him, life begins after coffee when he draws. He taught himself how to draw. He would go to the public market in Thailand and watch other artists. On that time, I'm not good enough. After that, I'm just a practice, practice, practice. He did have a dream. His soul cried out to be an artist. But in Thailand, the future was so painfully uncertain. Every business in Thailand collapsed. The people suicide themselves every day. Suicides? Yes. In 1997, he received news, a promising tip about a Thai restaurant in America in need of help, hope, if he was brave enough to trust the future. Where is North Carolina? Just let go. He arrived in North Carolina via Florida, speaking almost no English. But his art did speak to him, still, even after working all day every day at restaurants and warehouses. He was still drawn to draw. I like to drawing about old people, poor people. I love to drawing like Indian people because I love their culture. Music plays across the coffee shop and Yai steals a few moments at his easel. So difficult for me, so hard for me because I don't have anybody here and I'm not speak good English too. In the faces on the walls, there is so much expressed and yet something's missing, price tags. Have you sold many of your pieces here? No, I want the people enjoy, look and smile, go. You don't want to think about profit, you want to think about the art. Yes, how I feel about that picture. I put my feeling in, in, in that picture. He makes coffee, and even the coffee is its own art. It is his murals in the coffee shop, the colors and the cultures and the marketplace and the faces of Yai. I bet the people must love your artwork. I hope so too. I'm happy.